Hi class, in this search demonstration, I'm going to show you two different ways to search with Google and access news content. Currently, I am on the Google News site. That's news.google.com. Uh, you can also access it uh, using your uh, Google Apps menu option. You click the little uh, grid icon and select from the options news and that will bring you to this page. Once you're on the page uh, you can select a section that you're interested in. I've selected entertainment just to keep the search uh, light and fun and um, as I begin to look through the search results for the entertainment page, um, what I see here is that they have a featured story and then several articles associated with it. The first one here is, uh, was posted five hours ago, so that's relatively uh, recent. It's from people.com. You can see there's also uh, CBS News is uh, one of the sources listed and the New York Times is listed. So there's a range of different news sources there. But be aware that some of them are traditional news sources and some of them are online magazines like People where they publish news stories but they're not a traditional news source. Additionally, uh, blog content is sometimes published in, in these news searches. So you want to make sure as you're looking at uh, your source that you're identifying what kind of source it is. If it's a blog, if it's a magazine, if it's a, a news site, etc. Um, I also want to point out a couple of other things about Google News before moving on to regular Google search and filtering for news. And that is that it gives you options, right? So right now I'm looking at headlines basically from the United States, around the world maybe, um, but it's kind of focusing on uh, uh, stories that are popular right now, headlines that are popular right now. I could, of course, do a more specific search if I wanted to find uh, other headlines. Um, you can also switch to local results if you're looking for um, search for news that is happening around where you are. So if I push the local button, I now have a fresh um, set of search results that are all specific to San Mateo because that is where I am, right? And so you can adjust that and add additional locations to your search results. Um, uh, so that you can see news for where you are. Um, uh, um, finally, it will note the location and it's defaulted to the United States because Google knows where I am and it's defaulted to the United States. So all of these news results are um, focusing on the US. However, you can choose other um, languages and locations um, and get results in other languages and focusing on news stories from other locations. So for example, I could choose China and I would get different news results in a different language um, if that were my preference. And then you can of course use the menu to switch back. Um, uh, okay, so I think I'm going to do uh, one more search uh, example for you. Um, this time I'm going to switch over to Google's regular search. Um, so just Google's regular search bar. And um, as I look at my um, search results, I'm looking at the all section of my search results, which is the default. And um, you can see there's actually several news sources listed NBC I have a search result from NBC News from the entertainment site TMZ from something called the conversation I don't know if that's a blog or what but there's a lot of search results there as well as his official site and other information about Kendrick Lamar however I want to focus on just news so I'm going to use the Google News filter by clicking news from the option and now news from the um filter options. And now as I look through, all of my uh, search results are about Kendrick Lamar and from various news sites. Same thing applies here. You might see results from online magazines, um, blogs, as well as traditional news sources. So pay attention to the type of source you're looking at. Um, 
uh, I do want to point out that, again, you can use the Tools menu and you can filter this a little bit more. So if you click the Tools button, it gives you some options, which you can see right now are labeled All News, because right now it's just filtering for All News um, uh, about Kendrick Lamar. It says Recent, so it's looking for recent news about Kendrick Lamar, and it's sorted by relevance. It's looking for news that is mostly about uh, that, is, that is primarily about Kendrick Lamar. Um, but I just want to kind of point out a couple of things here. So the all news option. So again, if you know you're specifically looking for blogs, you can click the blogs option and just look for blogs. Um, but the really important option that you can use here is the one for the date that the news was published and posted to the internet. Um, it gives you, because we're talking about news here, it gives us a lot of ways to narrow that. Some of them are for very immediate. If you're looking for things that have just happened around the world, it lets you filter for things that have just happened during the past hour. So that'll definitely change what you see in your search result. And of course, there's several other options that you can use as well, the past 24 hours, the past week, the past month, the past year. You can go further back in the archives. And in addition to choosing those um, time frames, you can also select a custom time range. So for example, if you were interested in seeing search results that were posted about Kendrick Lamar right after his Grammy performance and his um, uh, Grammy Awards at the Grammy Awards show at, at the end of January, you can change the date range. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to look for uh, news about Kendrick Lamar from the time of the Grammys, which was January 28th, 2018. Uh, and then I'll just, you know, give it a week. So uh, February 5th, 2018, I'm going to click go. And now it's updated my search results. You can see here, instead of listing recent news, it's showing news only from January 28th through February 5th, 2018. And you can see that is reflected in my search results. So good luck with uh, all of your news searching. Use whatever techniques work for you. There are additional news search demonstrations posted in class. Thanks.